All right, as you're heading out this morning, it is a little cool 50s and 40s across the county. 30s, though, in our mountains, 49 in Poway and El Cajon, some of the cooler spots west of the mountains. Now as we head into tonight and tomorrow, as we look at 10 News Futurecast, you can see the colors indicating the stronger winds in our foothills and mountains, indicating those Santa Ana conditions. This will be a mild event for us, gusts anywhere from 20 up to 35 miles per hour. And then the humidity levels also dropping, most noticeable by tomorrow afternoon. We're not talking about single digit humidity levels, but between about 10 and 20% away from our coastline. So it will be noticeably drier, especially compared to the uh, the more moist atmosphere we had the last couple of days, due thanks to this storm system right here that is now pushing off to the east. So as high pressure moves a little bit farther to the east, you can see the circulation around it is gonna bring those Santa Ana conditions to with us. Those offshore winds, if you will, that's going to get tonight into Friday and then they'll start to taper off on Saturday. What's really going to notice is those warmer temperatures. 70s in the forecast for tomorrow and Saturday along our coastline. The sea breeze returns on Sunday. Could be waking up to a little bit of coastal fog and low clouds on Sunday. Kind of just depends on the timing of when that sea breeze returns. Mid 70s inland tomorrow and Saturday and then cooler back into the 60s on Sunday. Much cooler next week and a few storms are actually going to be passing by. Bringing a slight chance for maybe some drizzle, maybe a couple showers Monday and potentially again on Wednesday. We'll also see some strong winds target our mountains and deserts then.